manual override initiated. Cryogenic stasis suspended. Huh. Always wonder what it would be like to be frozen popsicle. Guess I finally got to know today. This is the one. Ella. Oh. Oh, Baldy. Hey, what are you at? Can you get me as well? Gonna be fine. Fine. Let the boy go. I'm only gonna tell you once. I'll let go go on you. I'm not giving you Sean. You really should have given him John. Get out of here. Let's go. At least we still have the backup. Hey, fuck you, Baldy. You really should have listened to him, you know? Oh well, your funeral. Very frozen funeral, but you have fun. I need to follow the instructions and, uh, well, evacuate. Uh, doodaloo. There we go. Anything here? Oh. All frozen popsicles. Oh, but I wasn't a big fan of bugs already. Did we have to super slice them? Oh god! You know, that's not so bad. Maybe it's friendly. We won't do anything. It's not friendly. It's not friendly. It's not friendly. Faster. You to see that the electric device water industry has uh, upgraded it's up a bit. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the long round. Well, the land that you camps aren't friendly, so am mine gonna be. Either he got eaten by the by the giant bugs, or he was stupid enough to try and take the shortcut. Do you shoot yourself, buddy? Oh, bosses. Ironic that I didn't see them before. Since, you know, I found any glasses to see. Cigarettes and. <laughs> Bedroom fashions, huh? Fucking pervert. Buddy, I don't think you're gonna find a lot of meat on that skirt. I suppose you do you. Let's see if this vault door still works or I'll be stuck here forever. Oh, forever is pretty long, I suppose, until it dies more accurate. So, is it? It's the start to a brand new adventure. I don't know what lies beyond this door. I mean, people still alive out there. Huh? 
Yeah, fucking damn it, Spryami. Oh, the... <sighs> why? Why is everything so blurry? Yeah, no, no, I was forgetting something. There we go. Oh. Being a little nasties. I have ready usage for. Oh. I think I just bombed my old neighborhood. Great distance on that one. Hmm. I wonder if I could. Oh, yeah, I could. I mean, beyond me being a terrible shot, that's a fucking amazing throw. Well, beyond the obvious lack of a monitor and internal hardware, I don't think the knife helped. Yeah, for the future. Yeah, you prepared right well for making it mean to fucking frozen dinner. Ass crack. Uh, back in my old neighborhood. I should probably go check on my house if it's still intact or not. No! No! My house! I took out a fucking mortgage for this shit! And again, I don't think the band is going to mind too badly with, you know, everything. Uh, I suppose I'll go talk with the gardener very bro. Ah. Uh, hey there. Hey, so. As I live and breathe. Oh, it's, well, you do it's leave it, really those things. You. Are you well, sir? Call me Codsworth, if you please. Right, so, Codsworth. There seems everything kind of died, huh? Everything's dead? Ah, yes, the garden. Uh, the posies have been uh, problematic, I admit. Ah, oh, if only the missus were here. I to wasn't help. talking about the garden. Where is she, by the by? Who? No, I live over there. Number 17. This is number 12. I think you got a few screws loose, old chap. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Oh, absolutely Shard not happening. does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Who's Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? Or oh, perhaps she's gone to the Parker residence to arrange a play date. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. I mean, there was that one child that got kidnapped. Not my fault, by the way. Just happened to witness it. Worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating no. properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm sorry, what, do you, what was that? 200 years? What? A, a bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> oh, still struggling a bit with the 200 years bit, but um, I, I'm good. Thanks. Sir, I've been thinking. If something is amiss... Your loved ones may simply be hiding from the Red Menace. Cotsworth, buddy. I think you kind of missed out on a mutual part of mutually assured destruction. I have an idea. Let's search the neighborhood together. Uh, yeah, sure. Whatever. Round two serve, sir. Oh God, what have I got myself into? I suppose my house could have been in worse shape. Oh, no. I dare say I'm 
slightly disappointed. Sir, your buddy, your family isn't here either. They're, they're really gone, aren't they? Is there any other humans alive out there? What about Conquer, sir? Plenty of people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. I liked them already. Oh, good. Maybe you'll get along then and they can help you find young Sean. I really should be glad he doesn't understand sarcasm with that sword blade equipped on him. Oh. Folks, let's have a quick look. He did say he kept this place in shape for a few years. Anyways, come on. Oh, I was definitely right about the baby belonging to them. Yours, your special bangs is the undiagnosed autism. You know, I've heard of kids putting firecrackers in. Trash cans and uh, mailboxes, but never grenade. And I wouldn't recommend it because, well, frankly, the fragmentation. Then again, I do suppose they say one man's trash is another man's treasure. Yeah, no, I, I, I deserve this. I, I absolutely deserve this. I'm sorry for stripping you, kid. Uh, I hope the river takes you someplace nice. Fun. Probably change out of this. Don't want it. like an easy target. Better. Ah. Uh, hello. Greetings, Vault Dweller. It's me. Terrified that you know, considering I just changed, so you'd be watching me get changed in the middle of the road. It must seem like a strange coincidence. Us meeting here. But I assure you that it is not. My name is Daryl. Short for D-A-R-R-Y-L. That's not short, I that's just spelled out. I have been to accompany you. By a group of people dedicated only to recording the history of mankind as it progresses after the Great War. A mobile encyclopedia, so to say. The organization has elected to provide you with my services. I can accompany you, and provide you with detailed information about locations and their history. In return for this service, I will document about the places you visit. Please express your preference at this point. I mean, sounds good. I... I need something to tell me what the fuck's going on, so... Yeah, buddy, come on. I will follow you at a discreet distance. As my systems do not allow me to interfere in any way, I will not engage in any form of combat, and will stay out of the way, should this ensue. Oh, so you're just a fucking coward, then. Stay, stay, no. Back off, back off. Stay. Stay. Ah. Yo, it's you. It's your good dog. Hey, is this your good dog? Oh god. Oh, moles were already problem before. I don't need this. This is not necessary to fuck off. Ah. Uh, well, that. That's probably also what caused the mole. It's very lovely. He peeped to you too.
Yes, beep beep. So oh, dark and over. Should we head off to Concord, see if there's anything of interest? <laughs> 